Michael continuing to wreak havoc across the U.S. Southeast Thursday, soaking Georgia, barreling toward the Carolinas, and leaving a trail of destruction across the Florida panhandle. The hurricane claiming at least two lives in Florida, both from falling debris. The Category 4 storm was the fiercest to hit the Florida panhandle and the third most powerful storm to ever strike the U.S. mainland. Michael's strength has waned as it churns through Georgia, downgraded to a tropical storm with top sustained winds of 60 miles per hour. More than 700,000 homes and businesses were without power in Florida, Alabama, and Georgia early on Thursday. The rapid intensification of the storm caught many by surprise, making landfall midday Wednesday near Mexico Beach, Florida, where homes were submerged in floodwaters and top sustained winds reached 155 miles per hour. The National Hurricane Center said Michael would pass through the Carolinas Thursday. You need to be ready to evacuate. The governors of North and South Carolina urged residents, many of whom are still recovering from Hurricane Florence less than a month ago, to brace for heavy rain, storm force winds, and more flooding.